I'm going to count from 1 up to 20. As I do, a light, easy, pleasant feeling moves into your right hand and into your right arm. As I continue counting, that feeling grows stronger and stronger. Soon you'll feel the first slight movement of your fingers, a twitching of the muscles. Then your hand begins to lift. Your arm begins to lift. It continues moving, lifting, and rising until it comes to rest upon your body. Now when you feel the movement in your hand and in your arm, don't try to resist. You could resist if you chose to, that is not why you are here. Just let your subconscious mind do its perfect work. All right, now we are ready to begin. Number one the first light, easy sensation moves into the fingertips of your right hand. Number two the feeling is spreading around beneath the fingernails. Number three it is moving up to the first joint of the fingers. Number four spreading to the large knuckle across the back of the hand. Number five the first slight movements begin to start taking place. Slight movements of the fingers, a twitching of the muscles. Number six the light sensation spreads all across the back of your hand. Number seven spreading over and into your thumb. Number eight moving now all through the palm of your hand. Number 9 the light sensation spreads up and into your wrist. Think of your left hand now. You'll see by comparison, your left hand is beginning to feel very, very heavy. While on number 10 your right hand grows lighter and lighter with each number I count, just as light as a feather floating in the breeze and even lighter as light as a gas-filled balloon. Just as a gas-filled balloon will rise and float towards the ceiling, in the same way, by the time I reach the count of 20, your right hand is moving, lifting, rising and floating. Number 11 The light sensation has moved beyond your wrist now, spreading into your forearm. Number 12, 13 once again, think of your left hand. Your left hand has grown so heavy, it feels as though it were made of marble or stone. Number 14 that light sensation is spreading up toward your elbow. Now on 15 from the fingertips all the way up to the elbow your hand has grown light, light and free. It's beginning to lift. It's moving, lifting, rising, and floating. All right, 16 now your arm is moving and lifting and rising. And as your arm is lifting, you're going deeper and deeper into hypnosis. 17 your hand continues moving, lifting, and rising now until it comes to rest over on your body. 18 moving, lifting, rising, and floating. Right on over now and when your hand comes to rest upon your body, at that time your eyelids lock tightly closed. Your eyelids lock so tightly closed at that point, the more you try to open them the tighter their locking closed. 19 Your hand is getting ready to come down and rest upon your body. 20 Now your hand has come to rest upon your body and at the same time, your eyelids are locked so tightly closed. The more you try to open your eyelids the tighter they are locking closed. That's fine, stop trying and go deeper into trance. Relax. 
Let a good, pleasant feeling come all across your body. Let every muscle and every nerve grow so loose and so limp and so relaxed. Arms limp now, just like a rag doll. That's good. Now, send a pleasant wave of relaxation over your entire body, from the top of your head to the tips of your toes. Just let every muscle and nerve grow loose and limp and relaxed. You are feeling more relaxed with each easy breath that you take. Droopy, drowsy, and sleepy. Deeper and deeper. So calm and so relaxed. You're relaxing more with each easy beat of your heart. With each easy breath that you take. With each sound that you hear. Relax more and more, relax. Let a good, pleasant feeling come all across your body. Let every muscle and every nerve grow so loose and so limp and so relaxed. Arms even more limp now. That's good. Now, send another pleasant wave of relaxation over your entire body, from the top of your head to the tips of your toes. Just let every muscle and nerve grow loose and limp and relaxed. You are feeling more relaxed with each easy breath that you take. More droopy, more drowsy, and sleepy. So calm and so relaxed. You're relaxing more with each easy beat of your heart. With each easy breath that you take. With each sound that you hear. Now, as you sink deeper and deeper, completely relaxed, I'm going to talk about tension, anxiety, and fear. How unnecessary these feelings are and how you, yourself, are going to eliminate them. When we come down with a cold, the general emotion we feel is inconvenience. Inconvenience, because you miss work, have little or no energy to accomplish daily tasks, and in general this cold just throws a wrench into our life. The same holds true for anxiety, tension, and fear. These are also inconveniences. If we go to work full of tension and anxiety, our work performance drops and it can cause tension among co-workers and make the day very uncomfortable. Tension is the opposite of relaxation and if tense or nervous our energy is sapped and we go through the day yawning and looking at the clock. Emotional tension drains our minds of much needed energy to accomplish the most trivial tasks. If fearful, we tend to slip into depression, bringing on these tensions and anxieties once again. Tension, anxiety, and fear are as much inconvenience as a cold, if not more. Tension, anxiety, and fear also bring on other inconvenience, the main one being illness and disease. Our immune system will not work for us properly if it's bombarded with negative energy. Your body involuntarily responds almost immediately to whatever crosses your mind. Think a pleasant thought and you smile. Think a melancholy thought and you feel sad. Think an angry thought and you frown. Think an embarrassing thought and you blush. Think a fearful thought and you tense. But tension cannot exist when the mind is calm. If we replace thoughts of fear with thoughts of calm and peace, our tension soon subsides and our mind's healing power continues working for us. In essence, we are what we think. 
One of the most important medical findings is that the stress of inner conflicts suppress the body's defense system, which then becomes unable to fight off disease. Also, keep in mind that the body and mind are a single integrated organism. As the saying goes you have nothing to fear but fear itself. You have no reason to fear a life-threatening disease because you have the power to reject invasion in your body. The responsibility of your health and your well-being is in you. You have the power to remain well as long as you have your mind and the determination. We each create our own miracles and we create our own downfalls, and as you sit here, completely relaxed and at peace with your body, you realize this. And this realization of a healthy body and strong, indestructible immune system, now becomes a permanent fact in you mind. You have no reason to feel tension, anxiety, or fear because you know disease doesn't have a chance of surviving with a strong healthy immune system. With visual imagery, which we will soon be working with, your physical health will remain as strong and pure as ever and with your new realization that you have no use for the inconvenience of tensions and fears. Your immune system can concentrate only on being strong and powerful against any disease. Now, I want you to visualize those two warriors you drew. Two vicious, strong, mean warriors. One standing guard inside each temple in your mind. These guards are now a permanent part of you. Each and every time a negative thought such as fear, or an anxious tense thought, starts to work its way into your mind, these warriors will savagely spear the negative thought out of your mind, out of your immune system process. These warriors are guarding your immune system for you and will never, ever, let negative thoughts into your mind to harm you or to disrupt your immune system's strength which is fighting inside of you every second. I am going to show you how strong these guards are. Picture in your mind the drawing of the sluggish, confused, disoriented disease which you have been fearing. Picture it creeping towards your mind, trying to put fear and distress into you. Now, see your personal warriors raise their spears, puffing up their chests in victory and are ready and standing guard again. Each and every time a negative thought tries to invade your mind, Every time a negative thought about disease tries to invade your mind, these warriors will fight and win. Every time. Without fail. Now, let's get rid of that dead disease lying there, having lost that battle. From the tip of your toes I want you to visualize a violet cleansing flame, flowing inside your body, working its way up through your body, up your spine, through your shoulders and neck. Feel it flowing throughout your body, cleansing and purifying until it reaches your head, where it flows out through your head and cascades down over your entire body, giving it a strong, protective shield of light. And, as this shield is cascading down over your body, you sink deeper and deeper into relaxation with the absence of tension and fear. Feel the tension and fear fading away with every breath you take. Feel the hope and joy which replaces these negative emotions. Every breath you take brings you closer and closer to relaxation and contentment.
Now, as you are completely relaxed, I am going to give you some suggestions that are going to take thorough and complete effect on your mind, body, and spirit. Permanently in your mind. 1. Each and every time a negative thought such as tension, anxiety, or fear tries to enter your mind, your two warriors will effectively kill them off. 2. These warriors, as of this moment, have become a permanent part of your being, always with you and always killing off negative thoughts. 3. Each and every time a negative thought has been killed, it will be removed from your body by the violet cleansing flame. 4. The violet cleansing flame will not only remove the dead, negative thought but will flow from inside of your body, through the top of your head and will cascade over your whole body leaving a powerful white shield of protection from negative thoughts and disease. 5. Because you are now aware of your own power of rejecting negative thoughts, you are becoming, with every breath you take, more and more relaxed. Your relaxation is so complete that you now make it a permanent part of your life. I'm going to give you a few moments of silence to let these suggestions take full effect upon you. Mind, body, and spirit. Each time that you use this method for easy relaxation, you relax more easily, more quickly, and more deeply. Relaxation is a skill that you are easily developing with trance. Now, I'm going to count from 1 to 5, and at the count of 5, you will allow yourself to go into a deep, relaxing, good night sleep. All right. One, slowly, calmly, allowing yourself to go into a deep comfortable sleep. Two, each muscle and nerve in your body is loose and limp and relaxed, and you feel wonderfully good. Three, from head to toe, you are feeling perfect in every way. Physically perfect, mentally perfect, emotionally calm, happy and serene. On the number four, you are going into a deeper and deeper relaxing sleep. Number five, you're relaxing completely and allowing yourself to go even deeper into that wonderful deep, deep, deep sleep now. Awakening in the morning at the correct time, feeling fully rested, refreshed, relaxed, invigorated, full of energy and happy, and having a good night, deep sleep.